after we perform the procedure. You are going to feel very warm, hot, and you may have some discomfort. So while you're here in our facility, we apply cooling measures, and that includes a fan, frozen towels, um, ice bags, many different ways to make the areas feel much more comfortable. But you can do the same thing at home. You can prepare yourself by putting a few towels in your freezer, and when you come home, just apply them to your face, and that provides significant relief. If we're doing larger areas, or if you're very sensitive, we can prescribe you pain medication to take home afterwards. Most people do just fine with a little bit of Tylenol and cooling measures. Afterwards, you are going to treat your skin very carefully. If you are very concerned about having specific products that you wanna use, we do have a post-procedure kit. That includes a gentle cleanser, a sunscreen that's not irritating, as well as nectar. So the nectar that you have used for two weeks before the procedure, you'll continue using afterwards. Um, you may just feel like you need to use it more than twice a day. Your skin may feel a little bit more dry. It'll be crusty for the first few days and the nectar will just soften everything up and it will make it much more comfortable. If you do not want to use nectar, which I do believe is much better, you can use Aquaphor or any neutral product that will hydrate your skin. While your skin is healing, you have to be careful about what you apply to your face. Not so much that you'll injure or affect your result, but it may be uncomfortable. Many facial products include a little bit of alcohol or other products that your skin, when it's raw, may find very irritating. So neutral substances like the nectar or aquaphor are really good. And usually in seven to 10 days, your skin will fully heal. At that point, it may still be slightly pink. The pinkness and the redness will slowly fade. It varies from person to person. Some people are barely pink and other people can remain pink for several months. As you're healing, staying out of the sun is super important because anytime your skin is exposed or we have taken that outer protective layer away, you're much more susceptible to burning your skin and creating more pigment and wrinkles in the future. So protect your investment, wear hats and sunscreen.